had 150 of our associates, team members, and we do an orientation before the season begins to make sure we're on the same page. The reason why I chose Lanza language is because of David Slade. I'm going to do them in English and I'm going to do them in Spanish. Voy a hacer en español y también en inglés. We uh, hired David to come in and speak for an hour and a half. He did a great presentation, which was high energy. It was fun. Uh, got people engaged. Oh, that was a picture of like, what's the work part of your job? El peor parte es tu trabajo. We've had a past relationship with David, and he, he knows customer service and has a lot of uh, insights. We all have different jobs, but we're all doing the same thing. Is we're all taking care of our guests. If one person doesn't do their job, si falla una persona, si fracasa, si no hace su trabajo, qué pasa? The system breaks down, right? What does the customer remember? The bilingual aspect is huge for us because we've got a large Hispanic staff. A lot of them don't speak uh, very good English. <laughs> While we're up there presenting, David can actually interpret and we can have everybody in the same room hearing the same message at the same time. El sueldo mínimo en México ahorita es más o menos 60 pesos al día. Todo el mundo que tiene trabajo, y eso es ustedes, pues debe estar agradecido por el hecho de tener un trabajo. Well, I really liked the marshmallow challenge. It was a lot of fun um, in the sense of kind of getting to know some of my teammates and then, you know, really understanding the experience. Definitely got the staff involved. Trying to make the working environment a better place for everyone. So I just want to say thank you and I really appreciate your help. It's key to get someone in here that is engaging and, uh, and gets them participating in the discussion. And that's David. And just remember to support each other so that we can support our guests. Thank you very much. Gracias.